Alrighty, let's talk. Okay, behind the scenes is Stefan. If you don't know who I am, my name is Stefan Van der I'm currently a 21-year-old entrepreneur, scaled my first agency to six figures, and I'm now starting up a brand new agency and scaling it to seven figures. And I'm documenting the entire process so that one day I can show my kids, hey, look, this is what I did when I was 21. Okay, but more importantly, I'm documenting the process to show all of you this can this can happen. This You can do the exact same thing that I can. If I can do it, so can you. And I want to share every single process, everything I learned, everything I do daily, um, so you can get a better insight into, onto my life before I was a millionaire. Okay, I'm manifesting it. I will undoubtedly become a millionaire. There's not a doubt in my mind that that won't happen. Um, that's just a matter of time. That's just a matter of doing the inputs, right? There's 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 just no question. Like now, if people always ask me, oh, like, you know, Stefan, how do you know? And I'm like, you know when you just have that feeling you just know? Like, that's how it is. Like, I know that if I just keep doing the inputs, I will get the outputs. Now, granted, will it take me one year or five years? I'm not entirely sure. But I do know that if I just keep doing the inputs to get the output I want day in and day out, regardless of the outcome, and just keep putting in the inputs day in and day out, day in and day out, day in and day out, eventually, I will get to where I want to go. Now, like I said, whether it takes me one year, 10 years, I'm not totally sure yet, but I am certain that if I keep doing it, I will get there. And so it's just a matter of showing up every single day and putting in the honest work. Like over the past, I want to say month or so, I've worked more than I ever have before and made less money than I ever have before. What the fuck? I've been working on average probably 14, 16 hour days almost every single day. Yep. Like like literally for context, right? Inside of my life, I work every day, 24 seven, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Like there will be days where it'll be a holiday and my mom calls, oh, what are you doing today? I'm, I'm working. Like, what do you mean? I Like I know people say, oh, I lose track of time. I quite literally don't even know what day it is. I literally never know what day it is. The only day, only time when I know what day it is, is Sunday for church, okay? Or Monday when my food arrives because I order my food. I get my food delivered to my door because I'm bougie like that, okay? And so that's the only two days when I truly know what day it is. Otherwise, I'd never know because it's just the same every day. There's like, there's no day where I wake up and, oh, it's Sunday, relax. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's the same every single day and it's boring. Let me tell you, if you live with me, man, it's fucking boring, right? Like, I literally live in my room. I just live in my room. My bed's right behind my desk here. I wake up, sit down at my desk, work. I work the entire day until I go to bed. And it's fucking boring. And it's lame. And it isn't very exciting. But this is the behind the scenes. This is the true, honest work that you just have to put in day in and day out. And so like I said, I'd be working 14, 16, sometimes even 18 hour days while making the least amount of money I have. Now, what the fuck? Right? It's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. And that's because we're building. And this is a concept that I, that I myself did not understand for the longest time as a young entrepreneur, and I still am. But I know that a lot of people do not understand at all. And it's probably one of the most important things that you as a business owner, as an entrepreneur, as a CEO need to understand. That is the concept of building, right? We all know the famous saying, Rome wasn't built in a day. And it really wasn't but look at rome it's still standing today it's still standing perfectly fine and so if you want to build something that lasts if you want to build something that's memorable if you want to build something amazing you have to build the foundations in order for that thing to happen and so most people don't do is they don't build they don't build their foundations they don't build their knowledge they don't build their connections they don't want to build they just want to make right? They don't want to learn. They just want to earn. And I went through that phase and I still am in that phase of, I just need to learn, right? Because the only thing that separates us, us from Elon Musk, right? The only thing that separates us from making a million dollars is we just don't know how to make a million dollars or grant or time, right? If you know how time, but most of us that you just genuinely don't actually know how to make a million dollars. Like you truly don't actually know how, And so the only thing that separates you from Elon Musk is Elon Musk just knows more than you. He has more knowledge. If Elon Musk was stripped of all his assets, of all his connections, he'd be able to make a million dollar business in a couple of weeks, but yet you still struggle to make a 10K per month agency. Well, why is that? Well, knowledge. He just knows more. And so the only difference between you and being where you want to go is you just haven't acquired enough knowledge and or done enough work, right? That's obviously one of the other portions of this, but I want to speak to more people who are seeing success, but aren't where they want to be. It's probably because you just don't have the knowledge required to get to where you want to go. And so lately, like I've been talking about one of the biggest things I'm doing is building, 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 building. And so what that looks like, people always, oh, give me an insight into your day. Well, give me an example, right? Last few days, we started running ads. Uh, the biggest thing I did today was learn. And I even talked to Andreas, right? My business partner, I was like, man, it feels like I'm doing nothing. Like I'm not, like I'm, I'm not really managing. We didn't have any call today. I was like, 
was like, I don't feel like I'm doing anything. Like, I'm just learning. I don't really feel like I'm taking action. Like, I, I want to implement. But I realized that this is so important. It's so crucial to be learning. The whole entire day, I just spent learning things about media buying, right? I spent learning things about psychology of, of different ads, different creatives, different copy, right? Like, different media buying techniques. I watched into other people, other successful agency owners. Okay, what does their thing look like? What does their process look like? What does their sales process look like? I was watching, um, I will listen to some podcasts. Just gathering information, taking notes, and then seeing what I can implement, right? I just, um, for example, what I did for the last 30 minutes here is I had to build out a sheet for all of our advisors, all our sales guys, to dial for the next day because basically we're doing a reactivation campaign for all our old leads. So I went in, I had to go through all the old leads, see where they were, write the notes, implement into a spreadsheet, make the spreadsheet, make it so it's organized, add all the follow-ups in there, add who's calling who, and then make a loom and send it to the team. Just boring stuff, right? Like, it's nothing crazy. I filmed new ads today, right? Like, I had to sit down, write the script, film new ads, and then I had to watch through all the ads because you film like 10 of them, and then you find the two best ones. Okay, boom, send it off to the editor. Okay, boom, now the editor's a bit confused. Hop on a call, try and figure things out. What can we do better here? What can we do better there? And it's like just day, boom, 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 just building, 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 learning, 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 implement, implement, implement. And so this is the behind the scenes in my life, like what I do, right? And it's just like, I have some tasks that I want to do tomorrow, but shit's going to come up, right? Like tomorrow, um, we're going to launch the new ads, Okay, so that's one of the first things we're gonna do. I have to film a new VSL. Um, I'm gonna schedule all of the branding and podcast for our, our Instagram and then uh, post the new podcast. Now, here's the thing. From this, it looks like I do nothing. But then tomorrow comes and then there's this problem, then there's this problem, then there's this, and then I gotta learn this, then I gotta learn that, and then, oh, the, the, this metric is down, let me learn about this. Oh, and then, then there's this problem, and then this team has this issue, and then this happened. And it's like, here's getting pulled left, right, and center. I guess I'm trying to fucking get at is my life Fuck, I would not trade it for the world. My life is amazing as it is. But I guess I want to give you guys behind the scenes, right? Like, whatever. Let's see, you, you're watching this, obviously, to learn a bit more about what what I do and how I'm planning to build a, build a million-dollar business. Um, and, well, it's by building an amazing team, building an amazing offer, and getting it out to as many people as we possibly can and shocking the fucking world. Like, most people, they want to make a million dollars, but they don't make a product that's worth a million dollars. And this is, like, a huge realization I had to have, had to have, which is that most people want to make money, but they don't have something that's worth making money. And so one of the first things we do is, like, how can we make sure we deliver such good results that people would be stupid not to pay for it? And you only can do that by acquiring the insights, by acquiring the talent, by acquiring the knowledge in order to build an offer that's actually good. And so that was like a huge realization that, fuck, you actually have to be good to make money. You can't just make money by being an idiot. Now, some people can't, right? Some fucking TikTokers or OnlyFans people, right? But most people, you... You make money by actually being good, by actually being valuable, by actually solving problems. And this is like such a misconception. People are like, oh, I want to make a million dollars by editing somebody's videos. Unless you're the best editor and you can double my retention and you can double my engagement. Who the fuck do you think? And that, and that's, now here we go again. You'd be a good editor. Most people, truth be told, are shit editors or shit media buyers. They're just, they're just shit. Now listen, you can say you're going to get offended all you want. The truth is, you're probably shit. And that's why you're not making enough money. Because if you're, if you're a short from content agency owner, truth be told, you can only edit videos. You don't actually want to make a video go viral. You don't actually know what a good hook is. If you did, you'd have your own fucking personal brand. You'd be, you'd be blowing up yourself. Right? So you don't know actually know how to get, make a good video. You don't actually know how to, what good hooks are. You don't actually know what's performing. You don't actually know how to make somebody blow up. You don't actually know how to, how to get more retention. You don't actually know how, to, know how to help people convert. You don't actually know how to get people to engage. Like, you don't actually know these things. You say you do, but you truly don't. What you truly know is you know how to edit a video. You don't even know how to edit it. You just put some fucking stupid effects on it. Don't even get me started on. Now, listen, I know I'm going off. This is me in the, me in the past. You just put some effects on and think it's good. Putting effects on video is not video editing. And for the media buyers, for the content people, right? I mean, for the ads people, it's like, dude, you're not even good at running ads. You don't even understand what all the fucking metrics mean. You just pop up a fucking ad, post it to some people, and, and pray to God that it gets you some results. It's like, and you wonder why you're not making money. It's because you're not exceptionally good. To get paid exceptionally well, you have to be you have to be exceptionally good. This is like a concept that most people miss out on. It's like, wow, I'm just actually not very good. It's like, that's the first problem I would solve if I were you. If I wanted to build a bigger business, a better business, I would become better first. Build the foundation, right? Here we go again. Build that foundation so you can scale higher. If you can build the foundation super wide and acquire all the knowledge and talents and insights, you'll be able to scale so much higher than you ever could before with so much more ease. And so it's one of the hardest things to do because most people hate the delay. 
fuck, I can't imagine working for five months without making money. And it's why you won't make a lot of money. Those who can endure seasons where you don't earn, you just learn, will make more money than 99% of the world. Because it's knowledge, right, that actually takes you to the next level. It's knowledge plus implementation. That's it. It's why people pay for coaching. It's why people pay for mentorships and masterclasses and masterminds, etc. It's because the knowledge. They don't they don't have the knowledge. If they did, they'd already be there. And implementation, right? Knowledge plus implementation. Now listen, I don't even fucking know what I was talking about again. Okay? It's late at night. It's damn near midnight. Okay? I don't even know what I was talking about. All I know is I started going off on a rant because that's what this YouTube channel is for. For me ranting. While I document my journey, scaling to a multi-seven figure, heck, who knows? Maybe in the future I'll be a billionaire, okay? Um, or a deca, deca millionaire. That's a little, bit, bit less than a billionaire. Who knows? Only time will tell. All I know is that I'm going to document the entire journey so that one day, if you're watching this and I'm a billionaire or a millionaire, don't be surprised, okay? Because I'm building for it as of now. But I want to show you that, hey, I'm just another kid that is sitting in his apartment, recording YouTube videos, building something, showing you that you can do it too. Okay. So anyways, I went all over the place today. And so if you're still here, then wow, I don't know what the fuck, if there's a problem with you, if there's a problem with me, one of us has a problem. Maybe it's both. Who knows? <laughs> but thank you. I hope that you, I hope that 11 minutes was, was of some value. I don't really know what I went over. So I would give you more of the story, but I honestly just forget what I went over. So I don't even know what to say. But I guess the uh, more of the story, <laughs> I guess the more of the story is just like, keep going, man. Like, I know it's so cliche. Keep going. Oh, I'll keep going. No, just keep fucking going. Like, don't quit. Don't stop. Just keep going. Build your foundation. Acquire the knowledge. Acquire the insights. Acquire the talent, right? Make a great offer. Build your foundation. Build your base wider than it ever could be, than you ever could need it to be, so you can scale forever. And just put in the work, right? Like I said, Last few months, made less money than I ever had before, but worked way more than I had before. Now, unless people look at, what the fuck? Oh, clearly you're an idiot. No, 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 no. I'm building my base. Right? And in a few months' time, oh, you're so lucky. You you did this, you did that. It's like, no, 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 no. I worked for that. I literally didn't make money for X amount of time just so I could do this. Sacrifice. Everything that's worth having in life requires sacrifices. Love is all about sacrificing. If you want true love, you have to be able to sacrifice. That's difficult for most people. It's why most people won't find true love, myself included. I'm <laughs> just fucking with you. <laughs> Damn, I like to, like, I don't know, something about, like, maybe I'm crazy that I'm sitting here talking to myself at fucking damn near midnight. Yeah, probably, to be honest. Um, but, like, everything, everything that's worthy in life requires sacrifice. And so, if you want something that's worth it, you have to sacrifice. And that's tough. Because it definitely ain't fucking easy. Because you got to swallow your ego. you got to swallow your pride. Eat the fucking frog. Bite the bullet. And go, I'm going to sacrifice this now. I'm going to sacrifice the short term so that I can have the long term. Sacrifice who you are for what you will become. Sacrifice yourself now so you can grow into that person that you truly want to be. Sacrifice short term success for long term gain. Every single time. Sacrifice short-term pleasure for long-term pleasure. Always. Sacrifice the short-term. We live in a world where everybody thinks in the short-term. Everybody thinks, oh, the weed, oh, just oh, make me happy. Oh, jerking off. Everybody thinks short-term. Let me go hook up. Everybody thinks short-term. Nobody thinks about the long-term. Nobody. And if you can think about the long-term in every aspect of your life, I can assure you, you will have a life that is so so meaningful, so purposeful, so abundant, and so truly amazing that I cannot even begin to explain how phenomenal it is when you can just think long-term but execute short-term. That is my advice I give to you, is think long-term but execute short-term. Anyways, I'm going to sign off now. I probably could sit here and talk for the next who knows how long, but I hope you enjoyed. Okay. Hope that this gave you a bit of insight, a bit of, I don't know, maybe guidance, maybe advice. I don't know why you watch these videos. Who knows? But I hope that you gain something from this video that you can now go and apply in your life so you can become a better version of who you are. Kaizen, continuous improvement, become better every single day. 
I could drag this on. I'm known for dragging this on. That's why I said 11 minutes and 33 seconds are all the videos ending. No, it's not ending. We keep going. Okay. But I truly hope that you got something from this video that you can go apply in your life and, and become better in any way, shape or form. If you have any certain things you want me to talk about, let me know. But granted, I just kind of like, whenever I f have like an idea, I just like talk about it. I'll just like press the record button on my loom and just like start filming. And so who knows? Maybe, like I know I've learned a lot about offers lately. I've learned a lot about Facebook ads and media buying. Heck, maybe next video is going to be talking about how to, how to actually build your offer, how to acquire insights, how to get better at what you do. How, what's the purpose of Facebook ads and how are the campaigns actually structured? How should you structure your campaign? What is the purpose of campaign ads and ads? Like, do you know? I learned that. I didn't know before. Now I know. So a ton, ton of things I've learned. Hopefully I'll share them with you all in the future uh, as I build this business to a uh, multi-million dollars and document the process so you can follow along and see me do it as well. So that's it for tonight. I'll chat with you boys next time. Peace.